What's up guys, my name is Atrarian Gaming and today I will be showing you how to get the Terra Blade. I just recently made a video on how to get the um what's it called? How to get the rainbow rod. And yeah. So basically for the Terra Blade what you need is Three broken hero swords, you get those from Solar Eclipses, and then what you need to do is get, um, where's the thing, True Knight's Edge, which is a Knight's Edge and a broken hero sword, a True Excalibur, which is an Excalibur and a broken hero sword, you craft the Excalibur with 12 olive bars, you get those from hol er, uh, you get those from mechanical bosses in hard mode. So then, oh yeah, you need to craft it on the Orc Outcome Anvil, and then you combine these two and another Broken Hero Sword, so that's three, so one, two, three Broken Hero Swords, so you make these with one and two, and then three, and then you get the Terror Blade. I have used the Terror Blade at my friend's house, so yeah, let's go use some Terror Blade. And yeah, I forgot to mention that the Terror Blade, it shoots projectiles. And as you can see, I duplicated, so I have an extra. So I could make a true Excalibur and a true um, Knight's Edge if I wanted to, to make another one for my friend. But, whatever. Actually, I'm gonna test out the... I'm gonna... Actually, no, I don't have another Knight's Edge, and I don't feel like getting all the stuff for it, so. Uh, yeah. This is. I'll tell you all the stats 95 melee damage, 25 critical strike chance, very fast speed, and strong knockback. So. You could probably beat Skeletron Prime with this. I know I have at my friend's house, but that's because I had full turtle armor, which is supposedly the strong. The best melee armor in the game, which is what I am. I'm a melee fighter. I'm not like a mage or an archer or anything. I'm a melee person. Look, see, just went right through that burn. Got to get rid of all these tombstones from killing the twins in my newest video. Yeah, look at all these tombstones. Oh yeah, there's some money. The solar eclipse that just happened. reason I got this weird thing called the eye spring from an eyesore. Basically it's just a bouncing eyeball. And the projectiles are like really fast too. And also the terror blade, you can't just hold it down, hold the trigger down or um, the clicker. You can't just hold the left click down or the trigger down on your controller or keyboard and expect it to just go forever because like automatically like the normal Excalibur but no you have to keep clicking the trigger or whatever the third clicker so yeah juice of Zeus the juice Bruce Paltman I don't know what I'm saying but so yeah I'm gonna actually try to beat Skeletron Prime after I make this video. Let's see. A Durpling is two hits now. But for some reason the grasshoppers still have are invincible. Look, look at these grasshoppers, they're invincible. Invincible grasshoppers. That's what. So yeah, this hair blade is really good. 
It despawns after a little bit, like the projectile. Yeah, see, it despawned right here. Right about here, where I am. But no worries. And it also produces light. That's cool. That, and that's a thing. Oh my god, look! Look at my eyeball. It's like flying with its little optic nerve. Look, look at it! It's flying with its optic nerve! Look! <laughs> that is... Cool, I guess. Let's probably put these out of this thing. And put all these away, but... So yeah, whatever. Yeah, that's awesome. Terrorblade. Amazing. I never thought I would get it. I thought I was the most unlucky person in the world in this game. But the Cutlass? How much damage does the Cutlass do? 66 damage per second? Like, look at this. No. Twice as... Let me see. Uh, 132 damage per second is how much this does. I think the cutlass might be better because it's automatic. You don't have to like keep flicking. Right here, I'm just holding my tr um, trigger button right now, and it's really fast. It's like two or th two or three hits per second. Yeah, it's probably like two hits per second. So, 66 times two is 132. I'm pretty sure. So. I still think Terrorblade's better because it's still pretty, it's still really fast. And it does 96 damage? 95 damage. And it's really fast. And it has projectiles too. And this is the best weapon in the game because how fast it is, the projectiles, the damage, 95 damage, my little fountain. guys so much for watching this video if you liked it please like this video and if you want more content please subscribe just some scribbles to my videos and yeah petri dish I have my actually two of views so yeah I don't know why I say it. so yeah so many times so I to and I'll see all you dudes in the next video Bye-bye.